Hey everyone, welcome back for another car wash video. Uh, today I am in North York, which is just a part of Toronto. And uh, at an SO gas station, just filled up full of uh, gas and purchased a luxury car wash for $12.99. Uh, if you don't get gas, it's $14.99. And it looks like it is another Ryko Radius system. Never been here before, so I wasn't sure, but they are definitely common f uh, common for having uh, this system, that's for sure. And uh, this is still a uh, on-the-run uh, a gas station here like the the variety store and that's on the run they haven't switched to the uh, to the circle uh, K yet um, oh one quick thing I want to mention here before we go in is uh, I'm very pleased to see that I've hit uh, the 500 subscriber mark uh, did that over just this past weekend and now I think I'm up to 504 or something like that so very special thanks to everyone that has subscribed to uh, to my channel and uh, greatly appreciate it. Uh, it's been just a little over a, a year, I guess, uh, about 15 months, I think, something like that. So I uh, wasn't sure how quickly it would climb and I've uh, been very pleased. So thanks again to everybody and like I said, I love the support and the comments and the interaction. Uh, everybody's had it's uh, been really really good hopefully I can continue to uh, post car washes and uh, and other things too I got to start reviewing some uh, other uh, other items too because uh, eventually at some point <laughs> I'm gonna run out of uh, car washes at least that are you know drivable for me I mean when I travel and stuff like that I'll come across ones but uh, they will uh, be a bigger time in between so anyways this guy's just leaving uh, code is uh, 02321 <clears throat> this guy's not really moving forward much at all I think he's afraid the dryer is going to hit his car or something he might not be familiar with it Jeez, that thing is beeping an awful lot. That's an underbody spray. Let's get the timer. I think it was the last Ryko radio system I did. I was very disappointed in it. I think it was the last one I did, so hopefully this one uh, redeems itself for the for the Ryko systems.
And we're going to get one pre-soak by the looks of it. Good coverage on the trifle. You can still see the soap on the on the windshield. So between the high pressure rinse and the and the rinse itself, didn't do a very good job getting all that soap off. job either. Camera's probably not picking it up but it's uh, definitely leaving water and I don't think the side dryers are doing anything. Man the timer cut out anyways. It was, dryers are horrible. Not good, but we shall see. Let me have a look at it here. Definitely lots of water left on the car. Oh yeah, the side sides of the vehicle soaked. Uh, The car wasn't all that dirty. That's why I didn't show a before picture, but oh yeah, there's still soap all on the back, the back of it. Because I know even on the uh, windshield, I showed you the soap that was left on the on the windshield, even, but it's. There's still soap on the back window and that, so yeah, can't recommend this one. This one's on the corner of uh, Finch and Dufferin Street here in uh, North York. And uh, yeah, I'm not going to recommend this to anybody. The, uh, there we go. The uh, rinse cycle uh, didn't do a very good job. Between the rinse and the high pressure rinse, uh, and it just, it, between the two of them, it couldn't get the soap off the the vehicle and then with the dryers not being good either uh, just left soap on the on the car so if this was a black vehicle I could just imagine the spots and everything that'll be that would be showing afterwards it would be uh, atrocious so 
anyways this is not going on to my uh on my recommendations that's for sure so let me know what you think in the comments below and uh and that's it everyone we will see you on the next one thanks for watching everybody goodbye